Welcome everyone. Today we are solving problem 7.59 from Sadiko book. The problem says determine step response VT for uh, v, uh, VT for Vs equals to 18 UT and in the circuit. So let's go to solve this problem. As we know from singularity functions, let's just solve this out. As we know from singularity functions that unit step function UT equals to UT is 0 when t is less than 0 and 1 when t is greater than 0 right t is greater than 0 all right so if we are using this condition let's say for t is less than 0 for t is less than 0 we can write as for t is less than 0 ut equals to 0 so if the ut equals to 0 then the whole car whole voltage source will be what 0 so then our voltage source will be 0 and so there no current source will be flowing through this car uh, inductor so if the voltage if there is no voltage then what current will be flowing so so i zero will be zero okay now for t is greater than zero for t is greater than zero ut goes to one and it is it will be in steady state mode right okay so if it's in steady state mode let's calculate this out so if the current sorry if the voltage here is 18 into 1 so 18 volt so the voltage will be here 18 volt right okay so if the voltage is 18 volt let's just calculate uh, this uh, the circuit's equivalent are equivalent actually so and replace the inductor as short circuit so it will be in short circuit and the equivalent will be what 4 3 4 3 into 6 right so the current i equals to i will be v by r equivalent right the total current i'm calculating total current the total current will be v what is the v 18 to 18 divided by 6 plus 3 parallel 4 right this is the equivalent so here the current will be uh, 18 divided by 6 plus 3, 4, okay. The current will be 2.33 ampere, okay. So we have calculated the current through whole circuit. So the current will be come through this terminal and this terminal and have two paths. So we want current through this inductor. So current through 4 ampere, we have to calculate the current through 4 ampere, right. So current through 4 ampere using current divider. So current through 4 ampere, it will be I infinity equals to what I infinity equals to what Cur using current divider it will be 3 divided by 3 plus 4 into total current it is 2.33 right and let's just calculate this it will be 0 0.999 or we can write it as 1 ampere okay we can write it as 1 ampere so current through this inductor will be 1 ampere we have calculated all the things now we have uh, left with the tau for our RL circuit we know tau equals to what L by R RTH for this circuit if we calculate RTH for these two terminal we can see 6 and 3 are in parallel which will be 6 into 3 divided by 6 plus 3 which will be ultimately 2 and 2 and then 2 and 4 are in what series so the RTH will be what 2 plus 4 equals to 6 and uh, L equals to what L equals to 1.5 so 1.5 divided by 6 which will be 1.5 divided by uh, 1.5 divided by 6 it will be 0 0.25 0 0.25 second Okay, 0.5. We have uh, gathered all the information, so let's just calculate the cu the current equation. I infinity plus V0, sorry, I0 minus I infinity and e to the power minus T by tau, right? So what we, what is the value of I infinity? The value of I infinity is equals to what? 1 ampere. So 1 plus, what is the value of I0? I0 equals to 0, so it will be ultimately 1 minus 1 e to the power minus T by 0.25 or we can just common we can just common the both side or uh, 0 0.25 1 divided by 0 0.25 uh, it will be minus 40 minus 41 minus 1.40 now they cal they wanted us to calculate v naught t so v naught t will be for inductor we know uh, the uh, voltage goes to l di by dt right so what is the value of l or inductance it will be 1.5 1.5 into d by dt of this d by dt of this will be minus minus plus 4 plus 4 e to the power minus 40 so 1.5 equals to 6 e to the power minus 40 this will be the voltage of this answer and as we are using singularity function it will be 6 e to the power minus 40 ut volt answer this will be the answer for our question number 7.59 now let's just problem number 7.60 the problem says find vt for <coughs> problem 7.60 the problem says find vt for t is greater than 0 if the initial current of the inductor is 0 there's they already given inductor current i0 equals to 0 so we don't need to calculate this anyway it will be any, anyway it will be 0 because if we calculate for ut functions we know 
if t is less than 0 then u2 will be 0 so if this 0 the current whole current will be 0 so there will be no current passing through this inductor so it will be 0 anyway but we don't have to calculate as it is already given in the question now for calculating for t is greater than 0 for t is greater than 0 we know what ut goes to 1 right for t, t is greater than 0 we know ut goes to 1 so if ut goes to 1 what will be the current what current will be 4 ampere 4 into 1 equals to 4 ampere and if it's in uh, steady steady state mode because the ut is equals to 1 then it will be in steady state mode if it is in steady state mode we can replace inductor as what short circuit so the whole current will be passing through this terminal and came back through its origin right so there will be no current flow through through this 5 ampere and no current uh, flow through this 2, amp 2 ohm uh, resistance right so the whole current will be passing through this inductor so the whole the current uh, the value of uh, current passing through this inductor will be as equals to the current source value so the i infinity will be what 4 ampere because it is short circuited right so i infinity goes to 4 ampere we have i in i naught we have i infinity now we have to calculate tau what is the value of tau for rl circuit we know tau equals to l by r right l by r what is the value of inductance inductance equals to 8 divided by what is the value of r rth equals to what rth equals to thevenin resistance through these two terminals for these two terminals what is the value of wait a second did i miss any values uh, let me just quickly check the question uh, oh okay it will be 20 ohm actually it will be 20 ohm actually all right so for these two terminals what will be the value of resistance 5 ohm and 20 ohm right so both are in what parallel so it will be 5 20 are in parallel so 8 by 4 so which will be ultimately 2 second right 2 second now quickly just uh, write it our equation uh, it it goes to what i infinity plus i0 minus i infinity e to the power minus t by tau right so what is the value of i infinity the value of i infinity goes to 4 plus 0 minus 4 e to the power minus t by what 2 right so it will be 4 minus 4 e to the power minus t by 2 now they wanted us to calculate vt so vt will be what vt goes to l di by dt so what is the value of l the value of l so the value uh, so the value of l will be 8 di uh, the differentiation value of this will be uh, minus half into minus 4 e to the power minus t by 2 right e to the power minus t by 2 so these this will be cutted out and the final answer will be 16 this will be 2 and 16 right 16 e to the power minus t by 2 volt this will be the answer Okay, this will be the answer for seven point problem 7.60. Now let's have head back to problem 7.61. The problem says, uh, in the current, if in the current is changes from 5 ampere to 10 ampere at t equals to zero, that is is equals to 5 minus ut plus 10 ut, right? They wanted us to calculate what? They wanted us to calculate v and i. We have to calculate v and i. So let's just use source transformation for merging up both of these so it will be looking like something this plus minus it will be what is is equals to what 5 minus ut so it will be 4 into 5 minus is to 20 u minus t plus 40 ut right and it will be in 4 ohm and it will be in inductor and this will be merging up it will be plus minus v and the current through this i it will be 4 ohm right now they, they has already given us uh, in the circuit current here will be current actually current anyway in the circuit current is changes from 5 ampere to 10 ampere so here already they have given i0 equals to 5 ampere and i infinity equals to 10 ampere they have already given this out now we have to calculate tau what is the value of tau tau will be thevenin equivalent resistance for these two terminals this uh, here we have one uh, already one resistance so it will be already one uh, sorry four uh, so it will be l by r so value what what is the value of l we have already given that the value of inductance we have written this it will be 0 0.5 actually 0 0.5 henry okay so the value of uh, l will be 0 0.5 and the thevenin value of resistance it will be 4 as there are only one resistance so it will be 4 so 1 0 0.5 divided by 4 equals to 1 by 8 okay now we have to just read uh, read the write the calculation i t equals to i infinity plus i 0 minus i infinity e to the power minus t by tau so the value of i infinity goes to what 10 10 the value of i naught equals to 5 and the value of uh, 
द वैल्यू ऑफ आई इन्फिनिटी विल बी टेन सो इट विल बी माइनस फाइव माइनस फाइव ई टू दी पावर माइनस टी बाई वन बाई एट सो द वैल्यू विल बी टेन माइनस फाइव ई टू दी पावर माइनस एट्टी राइट वी हैव ऑलरेडी कैलकुलेटेड आई टी सो वी हैव कैलकुलेटेड आई टी सो दे वॉन्टेड अस टू वी टी सो वी टी विल बी वी टी विल बी एल डी आई वी डी टी सो आई होप यू गैस कैन सॉल्व दिस आउट सो आई आई होप यू गैस इन्जॉय दिस वीडियो थैंक यू वेरी मच